Do you avoid applying eyeliner because you have excess skin over your lid that goes way past your lash line? Then this tutorial is for you. Today I'm going to be showing you three beautiful eyeliner styles for extremely hooded or droopy eyes. If you're ready, let's begin. If you have that extra skin on top of your lid and you apply your eyeliner, it might look a little distorted or different because it interferes with the fold of the hood. But there's ways to work around every eye shape including hooded eyes. A big part of working with hooded eyes is your brows. I'm going to be using the Makeup Forever Aqua Resist Waterproof Eyebrow Pencil in the shade Black Brown. Try to create as much space as possible below the brows by one, pushing it all the way up and second, by not overfilling it. I'm going to first brush my brow hair down so I can clearly see on top and just fill in the sparse areas. And then I'm going to brush my brow hair upwards so I can clearly see at the bottom and just fill in the sparse areas again. Even if you have very low brows, you can push it all the way up and create as much space as you can. Just maximize the space under your brows. Then using the e.l.f. Camo Concealer in Medium Warm, I'm going to clean up underneath the brows, that way the skin looks even. To avoid creasing, I'm going to lightly set it with the One Size Translucent Powder. If you have hooded eyes, avoid pulling or stretching your skin while applying eyeliner. Because once your skin goes back to its position, the eyeliner will look distorted. For our first style of eyeliner, a flat brush like this will come in handy. This is the ColourPop E31. I'm going to list a few of my favorites in the description box right below this video. Also, using a black eyeshadow as an eyeliner is more forgiving on hooded eyes. I'm dipping the flat brush in the black eyeshadow and looking straight in the mirror, I'm going to stamp it on my lash line. It's pretty simple, I'm just using my lash line as a guide and I'm just going along my lashes. Because it's a fine brush, it's very easy to get a thin line over your lashes which won't interfere with the fold. Next, see where your fold ends. Rather than creating a wing at the very outer corner that can interfere with the end of the fold, I'm going to mark a point that's almost at the very end but not quite and I'm going to pull out a wing that will go under the fold and I will then slowly join it to the lash line. To pull out this wing, a small liner brush like this will come in handy. Because the wing is going underneath the fold, it's not going to interfere with the fold. And because the wing is not at the very outer corner, it's not going to emphasize that fold and it's going to give your eyes a beautiful lift. For the second style of eyeliner, again, I'm taking some black eyeshadow with the smaller liner brush and I'm going to stamp it connecting my top and bottom lash lines in the outer corner. Using a small definer brush, this one's from Folklore, I'm going to start smudging this. By smudging this, it makes it look really soft and smoky, which is extremely forgiving on hooded eyes. And then I'm going to further soften it by using this large e.l.f. concealer brush by moving the eyeshadow outward and upward. For the last step, I'm taking a little bit more black eyeshadow and I'm going to deepen the outer corner with the small eyeliner brush, later pulling a wing with my finger. That'll give a lifted, elongated effect in the very outer corner while still keeping the eyeliner soft and nice. For this final look, I'm taking some black eyeshadow with the flat fine brush. Looking straight in the mirror, I'm going to extend my lower lash line going over the fold. I'm going to next join the tip of the wing with my lash line. I'm going to lift my brow and you'll see a small gap in the line so I'm going to join it. Using a little bit more black eyeshadow with a small shader brush, I'm going to start shading right under the tip of the wing. While I do that, I'm going to push the eyeshadow towards the lid. And then using a blending brush, I'm going to soften this further towards the lid. So it's going to be deepest or darkest at the tip. And as it moves towards the lid, it becomes softer and softer, finally fading into my skin tone. 
I'm going to line the lash line by stamping some black eyeshadow using a small liner brush. And then to finish up, I'm going to curl my lashes and I'm going to apply a coat of mascara. This is the Wonder Wand Mascara by Ciate London and while applying mascara, I'm going to push my lashes outward and upward to get that elongated effect in the outer corner. I personally love this eyeliner style because while the wing is big and nice, it is soft enough that it's not going to interfere with the hood. But I'd love to know which one was your favorite, so comment below and let me know. And if you enjoy such videos, let me know that as well. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. And do check out the description box for all the products that I used, along with links to my social media. I love you guys so much, and I will see you soon with a brand new one. Bye, guys. Bye.